Today's event is an IRC funded interdisciplinary research workshop which is happening in NUI Galway. We also have partners from DCU and Queen's University Belfast. I suppose one of the things about research now and European research is that it's focused on societal challenges, things like addressing self-management and chronic illness, uh, an ageing population and these kind of societal problems require interdisciplinary solutions. So really I suppose one of the barriers in previous research has been been that people from different disciplines can find it challenging to speak to each other, to communicate, to find an environment to share their ideas. So this was the aim of the IRC and their Creative Connections Award uh, in funding uh, a series of workshops of which this is one. The, the workshop kicked off with two really good keynote uh, speakers, uh, Catherine Woods from University of Limerick and Sally Wyke who's from the University of Glasgow who are both currently leading Horizon 2020 uh, projects. Pathway physical activity towards health is a technology enabled behaviour change self-management programme for people living with um, cardiovascular disease. The value of bringing multidisciplinary teams together to produce interdisciplinary research in my mind is that you approach a problem or a research challenge from multiple different perspectives so it allows you to approach in our case the problem of inactivity with people living with chronic disease from a behavioural change perspective, from a public health perspective, from an exercise perspective, but also importantly from a technology perspective. We had a Horizon 2020 evaluator, we had the National Contact Point for Health, we had people who have had success in terms of funding awards and they were all giving us advice I suppose in terms of what they found useful uh, in developing uh, interdisciplinary collaborations. Then the workshop broke up into two parallel sessions, one focusing more on early career research uh, and the other focusing on the actually talking us through the, skill, the, the, the steps of writing an application. The final session of the day is back to the quick fire uh, presentations actually showcasing five excellent examples of existing Horizon 2020 projects uh, and asking people really to reflect on what they have done that they found successful, what they mightn't repeat again and trying to learn from those lessons. I suppose a key thing in the day is to set up links and we've got great representation I think from all around the country and we've tried to embed opportunities to allow people to speak to each other as well. The value of a conference like this is one in meeting with people you already know and supporting each other in your research but also importantly meeting people that you have yet to get to know because they come from different backgrounds and maybe your paths haven't crossed in relation to the research that you're doing. What it allows is for a spark of imagination to be created in relation to solving that problem and coming up with a new solution, an innovative solution, that on your own or in an isolation you may not have thought of.